Hi, I'm Jeff from Sussex Installations. Today's customer, got a very special customer with us today. We've got Thomas Nagy come back to us. Ah, it's good to be here again. <laughs> so how's it all going? All right, not too bad, yeah. This is the third van you've done of ours now, I think. Third, yeah, you've done two traffics. And now this, uh, and now this truck here, the Runner Master. So yeah, I came down here again just to uh, just to do the locks on this one because this one had absolutely no security on it at all. So uh, yeah, it's a worthwhile investment, I think, definitely. Cool. Well, look, thanks for making the trip down to us. No, I appreciate Hopefully it. Hopefully, yeah. we've looked after you enough today with some coffee yeah. and. All right, so he looked I've after been you. Fried with coffee all day. Yeah. He he bought the lunch. Would you believe it? What a nice, super nice guy. Yeah, oh, where did it go actually? It wasn't the side of the van, it's dis it disappeared actually. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah it disappeared into Danny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I had one bit of chicken, the rest of it disappeared, yeah. No, it's still around. Right, so look, let's, let's show you what we've done. So deadlocks, you know deadlocks. We've uh, you've used them on your other vans before. We've got two deadlocks on this on this side load door, which we've done for you. And this is the hook style lock. Turn the deadlock, turn the key, and then if you try the door, if they get past the, the factory lock in. That's it. That's as far as it's going to go. So if I just take that off, which if I can coordinate all this, that's it. Perfect. So obviously, no no locks on your back doors there. <laughs> no. no. And then the, the, the hook dead lock. So yeah, it just pops out, rotating it in the clockwise position for lock. Same for the bottom one. Of course, we did do something a bit special for Tom today as well. A bit of a development inside this door. So for the internal shielding latch security, we didn't actually have one. Charlotte managed to book it, and in my mind, he had a transit van. I don't know why I thought he could come down a yeah, transit van. Yeah, yeah. So we got all our bespoke internal shielding for the transit. So when he arrived in this, I thought, yeah. I thought, oh, I mean, of course, she had the right locks. <laughs> Everyone else knew yeah. the plan. It's just I didn't for some reason. Um, cab door deadlocks, same thing. We've managed to fit hook cab door deadlocks. Typically, the cab doors were on a like, standard sort of deadlock, but we have managed to get hook locks on this vehicle for you on this occasion. We got the alarm system, PIR, which is up here. So any any movement inside of the van, even if someone was to come through the roof, that's going to go off. And we've got the high position pin switch up the top here, in case someone's to start like a peel and steel attack, just to give an early indication of it. You've got your own own armor plates. You know about them. Cause you fitted them yourself. Yeah, I, yeah? I fitted those myself. I was so wary about just when, because when this is sat outside, it's just I don't know. It's more of a visual aesthetic thing. It's just, I actually don't know 100% how much protection they give, but it's just, there are so many opportunists who just, you know, if they, if they look at a van, if, it, it's, if something's got a little bit of armor and a bit of protection on it, it's just easier to go to a van six vans down and just yeah. break into one with no protection on it. So I think it's just for the, the visual aesthetics, it's worth it, you know? Sure. And obviously the alarm, it's got visual indication, nice, super bright blue flashing LED, which is just up the top by the interior light just up the top there. It is protected on that PIR, it is got on the high position switch, any of the, the doors or the bonnet that are open, that will set the alarm off as well. Um, we've got the ultrasonic sensors in the cab, some to break a window and lean in, and then the visual of the, of the LED. The alarm itself will turn on with a factory key. You can have it disarmed with a separate key or with this key, it's, it's up to you. It's more convenient if it's all on the one key. There is some extra added benefit from security if you have it on a separate key for the disarm, but it can be a bit of a faff, so so much nagy. I like that. That's, that's good, isn't it? I like it. It was simple, yeah. We had a graphic designer doing it. I think it's quite nice. It's just simple and effective, yeah. Yeah, very nice. 
Well, look, thank you very much for no, coming down to us here, really the Sussex Installation, making the trip down. And um, we'll look forward to seeing you no, with your next video. Honestly, no, they are awesome guys here. They really, really are. They know, they do know their stuff. So it is worth, honestly, for van security, they are absolutely, honestly, the people to go to, 100%. Thank you very much. No, much appreciate appreciated, it. Really as do. always. I appreciate cheers. it. We won't, won't do the handshake or the fist bump with all the confusion that went on this morning trying to do it. Anyway, if you're looking for security for your van, get in touch via the website. It's www.sussexinstallations.co.uk. Thanks for watching.